29 nations on the line. Five laps plus a start loop. This is the 2020 Cross Country Olympic Women's World Championship here in Leergang and we're off. Ooh, Brando already crashed of her. Brando's gone down. And Are another pile up on the inside as well. And the start is always very important. Pauline Frampravo right with her on the number one. Well, wow, determined. And if she gets a gap bar, we know that if she can, she will control it. That's what she did last week. Uh, she had a gap of 15 seconds to her uh, on a Terpsa. Here she is. Exactly why opening up a fair gap already. This is dangerous, I'm going to say, even on the start loop. Especially uh, that quick in the race. Uh, yeah. She shows her form, she shows her strength. And these are the descents we're talking about. Incredibly technical. Uh, very slippery still, it is. A lot of roots. Good start for Pauline Ferrand Prevot yes. so far. Long way to go After in this the race. Start lap. McConnell on the number four, trying to close her down. She finished third last year in Monson then. Yeah. Also, Rebecca made it still here on her bike. Chasing group is coming down. Evie Rachels. Whoa, out. throwing it in there like a downhiller. Behind her. Ayla Short coming down. Whoa, crash oh. for her. Back to the leader, to Pauline Ferrand Prevot. Two times a world champion in mountain biking, this woman. The road world champion, cyclocross world champion. So what's the gap? It's nearly a minute, but as they go out onto lap two. Wow. A huge battle for the bronze medal from the Ukraine, Jana Bilomoyna. Bronze at the 2015 World Championships in Andorra. Like I said, silver medal here in South Raiden. Cena Fry slip sliding back down. Yeah, Fry is on a move for the third. Oh, a problem for Jana Bilomoyna as well. It looks like her right seat, a... drop of seat pose is not coming up. So they're a telescopic seat post, and basically Jana's is stuck down. Oh, Cena Fry now. Looking like she's going to be putting the hurt on Eva Lechner any second. That was three and four in the race. Golden helmet, golden woman. Out front. Big gap already. Which, which part is really muddy, very slippery. Here's Pauline, a little bit dirt on her shoulder. Saw her fall off. Whoa, and another one. Saves it well. She has a little bit of time to play with. Gonna have some work to do on the way back down if she's gonna close that gap. Silver medal for Australia at the moment with this woman, Rebecca McConnell. But it looks like Eva Lechner is coming back to uh, Rebecca. Yes, yeah, it does. Here they are. That's right. So that's a fight for for silver. That's right. This might get good in the last lap. Lechner's going to go for this, so we've got a real fight on our hands for this uh, silver medal on the last lap. Ah, oh, Lechner goes! So Lechner's gone for it! Can McConnell respond? Yeah, but what a performance for Eva Lechner. To see her on the podium. No, uh, Rebecca responds. An attack of her. No, why? Trying to go round the outside of the Italian, and then a mistake from Eva Lechner! All in for Ampravo then, the leader. Bravo flying on these descents. So Pauline Perrin Prevot has done it, successfully defended her title from last year. Pauline Perrin Prevot is your 2020 UCI Man of Cross Country World Champion with an unbelievable performance, leading from start to finish. The fight for the second place. Where is Eva Lechner? It's going to be silver for Australia if it stays like it is. If the riders are under pressure. W for Rebecca McConnell, she does go down. So McConnell's down, where's Eva Lechner? There she is. Lechner, too far back to capitalise. Rebecca McConnell is going to do it. She sprints for the line. Here comes the Australian then. It's going to be Silva. Is it or not? Or is it going to be Eva Lechner? Eva Lechner. Has it's it. Eva Lechner who takes the silver medal. Wow, snatches it away. And it's also great to to be able to defend it. So I'm super happy. It's a good day also for France with uh, the title of uh, Luana in under 23. So um, yeah, it's, it's a really good day for us.